Hello everyone! Welcome to Nian Secondary School. I am Zainab and he is Paul. And we are so excited to show all of you around. Join us as we show you what our home in school looks like. What, you may ask, is unique about Nian Secondary School? Well, we are a school of possibilities. There are so many opportunities awaiting all of us. Each opens up different possibilities for our four to five year journey here. While we all come to the same school, each of us will carve our own story based on our interests and strengths. Every student's journey is different. How exciting is that? Yes, yes, I agree. I really like the vibrant secondary school life here. Our teachers plan many exciting learning experiences for us. Each experience is an opportunity for me to discover and develop myself. NES truly provides us with many extraordinary experiences, one extraordinary school. Come join me on a school tour. Zainab, I am so excited to join you for the tour, but I have to go for lessons now. Catch up with you soon. Okay, Paul. See you later. Are you guys ready? Let's go! Do you know that all lower secondary students take food and consumer education as one of our subjects? What this means is that we get to spend time in the gastro lab whipping up healthy meals. My friends and I like to pretend that we are contestants in Master Chef Nian when we are cooking. Just take a look at our gastro lab. With a kitchen like this, it is no wonder that all of us look forward to FCE lessons. Come on, let's head to our next stop for some exciting hands-on activities. This is the Design and Technology Workshop. We have another one for Upper Secondary over at the next block. In DNT, students conduct research to identify a real-world problem. My favourite part is ideating creative solutions to the problems we come up with. The students then prototype their design in the workshop using different materials like wood, plastic and metal. I also get to use the school's laser cutter and 3D printer as I build my prototype. I especially look forward to the Nian Maker Fair where our students can sign up to learn 3D modelling and 3D printing. With our own 3D printer, what we can create is only limited by our imagination. The possibilities are indeed endless with the DNT equipment and facilities we have. Now, let me take you to another part of our school that is uniquely Nian. Hi Paul, what are you doing here? Oh, it's my recess time, so I can join you for the tour. Hi everyone, this is my favourite spot in the school as I am such a science fanatic. I love sitting at the periodic table to pick up some basic chemistry. The periodic table, get it? Pun intended. <laughs> Go on, take a closer look. Why is this table my favourite? It's because I am such a scatterbrain. I always have difficulty remembering all the elements in the periodic table. Doing my assignments here really helps me to remember them. For me, this area also provides Nasians with a serene and conducive place for self-study and project discussions. I like that it is right next to our eco-garden with its lush greenery and big koi pond. If you're lucky, you may even catch Tommy, our giant terrapin, taking a walk in the garden and passing by you. Zainab, look at those paintings. They are amazing. Did you know that in 2012, we became a centre for the Enhanced Art Program? This room on our right is our art studio. It is where all our EAP and art club students do their magic to conjure up fabulous artwork. There's always some work in progress going on in here. Just see for yourself the quality of art produced by my friends. NES is truly a school with amazing possibilities. Paul, oh dear, I have to run. I have an appointment to discuss my VIA project with my form teacher. I will be exploring an idea that I have with her. See you later! Okay, see you! Look guys, this next venue is also one of my favourites. It's the science lab! I think you can figure out by now that my favourite subject is science. Ladies and gentlemen, 
this is our science lab. Over here, you will get to dabble in solving chem mysteries and carrying out science research and experiments too. I still cannot forget my experience of viewing 3D molecular models and human body parts in here. Oh, and do feel free to browse for science posters designed by our Sparks program students as part of learning effective scientific communication. Don't forget to check out the science project artifacts created by my lower sec friends too. The collab is used for our humanities lessons. Again, notice how different the room looks. You're right, such a seating arrangement allows us to collaborate and learn. It also gives it a homey feel. Away from the traditional setup of a classroom, our ideas flow more freely and our discussions too. The next room, the word works, is used by the English teachers to carry out collaborative, IT-based English lessons. It is also where literature lessons come alive. There is a mini stage that our literature students love, as they get to act out the scenes they are studying. Check out all these photos of woodworks. Okay, now let me take you to a place which elicits a lot of oohs and ahs when we open up our school for the annual open house. Let's go! Welcome to our indoor sports hall. Nasians are no stranger to the ISH. We come here very often for PE lessons. See that wall over there? We have our very own rock wall. We love climbing it during PE class. I must say, each time I climb it, there's always a new challenge. We have a large variety of modules for our PE lessons. This rock wall stretches our individual limits and complements our PE program, which has a spread of seven different games, as well as challenging fitness and innovative games modules. The possibilities are endless. In fact, a number of us have gone on to try climbing the rock walls at places like Climb Central and the Rock School. If not for what we have experienced here, we will never discover our love for climbing. Oh hello Zainab! It's great that you can join us again. I am done showing our friends the venues that are related to the subjects we take, so now I am showing them the venues that we use for our CCAs. I am so excited to share as International Dance is my CCA. As you can see, the dance studio is a fully air-conditioned space designed specifically to provide a conducive home for our dancers. The floor-to-ceiling mirrors are very useful in allowing us to check our posture and be in sync when we dance. Paul, where is our next venue? Since you have shared with our viewers your CCA, it's my turn now. Catch up with me now. Welcome to our auditorium. In case you're wondering, my CCA is Jam Band, and this is where we practice our acts. The auditorium walls are soundproofed, so Jam Band members can play our music without worrying about rocking the school. The acoustics is also very good here. We get to hear ourselves when we have played badly, so there is always room for improvement. The auditorium also brings back fond memories of my first time here in Nian. It was the open house, and my parents dragged me here to listen to the talk by the principal. Am I glad I didn't resist? Did you know, the auditorium is also used as the rehearsal venue for our performing arts groups in preparation for the SYF? Yes, the auditorium is a multifunctional venue. Where shall we go next, Paul? Let's go to the heart of all our CCAs. I was really curious about where the heart of our CCAs is. Now I understand. From this point, we can see the outdoor volleyball court and basketball court to our right. And we can also see the school field and running track. Our sports CCAs use these venues. Actually, our uniform groups also use the field to practice various structure building and tent setting skills. They also fan out on the quadrangle. All our uniform group CCAs use the quadrangle to practice their marching skills. I love how smart they look in their contingents during our National Day celebrations. Heard you took a look at the ISH just now with Paul. The ISH is not just a venue that we use for PE lessons. Our basketball, volleyball and wushu teams also train there for the national competitions. Our school is abuzz with zeal and energy during CCA days as practically all parts of the school are used for CCA practice. There is one more venue that we need to show you for our CCA. 
Let's go! The multipurpose hall is where the school assemblies are held every morning. It is also where we hold large-scale events and performances. Even our national examinations are held here as the MPH provides a very conducive environment for the exams. The aircon sure helps us to better concentrate on our papers. Let's not forget that this is also the training venue for our badminton and table tennis teams. On CCA days, the MPH is entirely transformed. Everywhere you turn, you see the sports groups, the performing arts groups, the UGs, and the clubs and societies. Did you know we have an outdoor adventures club too? Technophiles can go for robotics. Or, if you're a strategist, check out the chess club. Our chess masters do very well in the East Zone indeed. Paul, I think we are done with all the CCA venues. Shall we show them parts of the school that are uniquely neon? Wow! What is this place? I've never seen such a classroom before. Oh, this room is what we call space. From the layout of the room, you can see that tech-enabled and flexible environment allows for a fully immersive experience for students to learn in. This is where our teachers innovate with student-centered pedagogies to design really cool learning experience for us. NAS is at the forefront of technology. Our students have been using the iPads for their lessons as part of our one-to-one -one computing program that started in 2011. We were conferred with future school status in 2012, which gave us a good head start in tech. All Nasians are adept at using technology to learn in and out of the classroom, as we explore new frontiers. We also have three other computer labs, and these are where our computing and smart electrical technology applied subject students go to for their lessons. Did you know that Code at NES is one of our distinctive flagship programs? Code at NES seeks to develop all students in computational thinking and smart students in applying tech to help the community. Smart students for a smart nation. NAS is one of the few schools that offers applied subjects like smart electrical technology and O-level computing. In fact, that is the main reason why I wanted to be a part of the Nian family. I've always loved science and technology. The building of foundational computing skills and computational thinking will prepare me to be a future-ready citizen of this digital age. This is the Pinnacle, a free and easy gathering place for our students after school to socialize and do our work. They usually come here and play a few rounds of board games or chess as a way to unwind from learning or before CCA starts. The idea for the social corner and study area was an initiative by our student council. This place is so popular that my friends and I have resorted to choke the seats with our bags. Did you know that there is another venue in school that has a similar concept? Welcome to the Hangout. Have you been here before? Yes, I have. It's a cool place to hang out. Get it? Get it? OMG, sign up. That is hilarious. Anyway, did you know that the Hangout was the brainchild of our normal technical students from the class of 2018? In 2017, they envisioned a space in which students can go to after school to simply relax and spend time with friends. They put forth their idea to our school leaders and were then encouraged to put their plan into action. Even the name Hangout Out was mooted by students through a naming contest. This is the kind of school NAS is. A school that is full of possibilities. There is one other place where students flock to to do their revisions and projects, and that is the library. But I think we are running out of time, so we will take you there when you join as Nasians. Hasn't this been an amazing tour? With its many facilities, NAS is indeed a school of possibilities. NES is not just our school, it is also our home, a home we grow in. Join us and be part of our many extraordinary experiences in this one extraordinary school. We are glad to have been your host today, and we hope to see you again next year, in our school uniform. Bye-bye!